to my channel. Happy Friday. Today's Friday. Today's gonna be a good day. I put stuff like this out in the universe. Today we are going to be doing what well, I'm gonna be showing you guys my sweat pool foundation routine for the summertime. Because you know it's hot tamales outside. So I've been doing this foundation routine for a week now and I've been really keeping a close eye like hmm am I sweating now am I oily now no so I'm gonna show you guys what I use why I use it and how I use it so if you are interested in seeing my sweat proof foundation routine full oily skin because I really have oily skin like from 1 to 10 I am a 7.5 so without further ado let's get into this video but before we get into this video make sure you click that subscribe button did you click it yet okay now we can get to it we are going to start off with primer first I'm going to go in I'm, today I'm going to be using like um products that I haven't used in a while because I don't know you know you buy new things and what you was using before you kind of leave it alone not on purpose but it's just like uh oh i got something new so i'm gonna just use this all the time type of thing so um i probably use this once on my channel so i'm gonna use the elegal pro prep high definition smooth and face primer <laughs> beauty blender and I'm gonna just spray the elves the elves um elves oil you control mist I love this stuff this stuff is bomb this is my second second bottle so good so I'm gonna just take my beauty blender and just press everything into my skin yo TMI but my um my menstrual cycle this month tore my face up. Like I had pimples everywhere here, under my eye. Like who does this here? Like I'm like bro. Like my menstrual cycle tore my face up, and I'm just looking like like what is going on? So I just been drinking water these past couple of days to really like get it together even though I always drink water but bro like they really invaded my face this month like I'm not feeling that but anyway now I'm gonna go in with the prep prep and blur stick because I like to um smooth out my um pores even though my pores aren't as large as they used to be but they really um I just want it to be super smooth in this area so I'm gonna just use this prep and blur stick I've been using this for a while. This is um this is still the first one I bought. This actually lasts it's been months since I had this, so and you don't have to use a lot. So now I already did my eyes off camera because this isn't an eye tutorial, but I did create this little cut crease right here using the elf's matte eyeshadow jewel pop and the other elf eyeshadow mad for matte too. Hmm. Haven't used these in a long, long, long time. So um now what are we doing we're doing foundation so you already know i'm using the color pop now like color pop has been my s-h-i-t like color pop been doing this thing like five very 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 long. nah but color since i've did i did a review on this i would definitely link this in the description box and have it pop up in the cards but this foundation right here let me just let me just tell you let me just tell you this foundation right here. I'm going to use this brush here. This over brush I have not used in forever. Like, I need to really get my life. So, I'm going to use this. I'm going to put, like... I'm going to put some of this on this, um... Right? And, and just put it on my face. Like, I don't know why. I've got all these brushes and stuff. And I do not use... Look at that cover. <laughs> So now we're going to go in 
going with concealer. I'm going to use the ColourPop No Filter Concealer in the shade Dark 46. I'm sorry, I didn't tell you what shade I'm in in the foundation. I am in Deep Dark 190. I will link every I will link everything I use in the description box as well. <laughs> in with the ColourPop No Filters Banana Setting Powder, Under Eye Setting Powder. This powder is literally like no filter, like it really smoothed out my other, my under eyes as well as my pores, so I really love this powder, like this powder has really been light, like no lie. Um, so now I'm gonna go in with my Elf Cosmetics um, Dewy Setting Mist. And I'm gonna just spray that all over my face just to let everything sink in. As a matter of fact, wait. I'm gonna go in with my Cat Von D Shade and Light Palette Contour Palette. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna contour. So I'm gonna do all my powders first. Then I'm gonna set. <laughs> done now all the powders I use on my face are finished like I'm done using powders so I'm gonna go in with my elf dewy setting mist I'm gonna let everything sink in I'm not even gonna fan it I'm gonna just let it do its thing okay now that we're dry see how we look matte but we don't look dry I got you right now so now so now what I'm going to do is apply highlight. Now I'm going to also show you a trick that I use to keep my highlight to stay on all day. Elf Cosmetics Power Glow Highlighter. So I'm going to just put this on my Elf's um, foundation pan. Y'all yeah, know I love this pan. So freaking much. It's freaking helpful as heck. And I'm going to just take my beauty blender. Just put a little bit. Just mix it in. You know, blend it in or whatever. And I'm going to just apply these on my cheeks. Everywhere that I put my highlight, I'm going to apply this. Make sure you blend it in. You don't want it to look like a, just a line. Everywhere I put highlight, I'm going to put this liquid highlighter. And it's like a nice subtle highlight. But y'all know I like my highlight to be beaming. Like it has to be like a freaking, I don't even know. Like it just has to be beaming. Like that's just how I like it. So I'm going to put it everywhere. I put I put my normal powder highlight. Did I put it on my forehead? No, I'm not going to put it on my phone because I got pimples up there. We ain't got time for that. So I'm going to just put it everywhere. Now I'm going to go in with my... I'm going to go with my Nicole Guerrero palettes. Nicole times Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighting palette. And I'm going to take my fan brush like I always do. And I'm going to go in with 143. Too bad this don't got a mirror, but whatever. And I'm going to just place it on the highlight. See how quick it's like it's like a once you put a liquid base, it helps it stay more and you don't have to use a lot. Because powder powder rubs off. Liquid, you gotta really like, you know? So you see how beaming this highlight is, like bro. Look at this. Like this is not even funny. I'm not even playing. Okay, now um, to finish off the face, I'm going to go with my Makeup Forever Face Powder, and this is in the shade 178. I don't have any other powders I use. This is basically my only pressed powder, which is weird, but sometimes I forget to use it. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I really forget to use this, and I just forget, and I'll be like, why am I so oily, depending on what I'm, what foundation I use, and i just be like, wow. Oh, you forgot to put a face powder, honey. I also use a... I use the Urban Urban Decay Setting Spray Oil Control as well. 
because I want I don't want to look I want to look matte but I don't want to look dry I don't want my skin to be dry even though you're oily you're not supposed to let your skin just dry out just because you produce a lot of oil you're not supposed to so you have to still moisturize your skin you still have to wash your face etc always be moisturized but don't you know over moisturize you can always do both like I used a little dewy setting spray but I'm gonna top it off with an oil control I want to be dewy but I don't want to look greasy that's the issue I'm gonna go in with my Ch MAC chestnut lip liner and I'm gonna go in with my Aaliyah times MAC cosmetics lip gloss sorry lip glass in the shade Motor City Lily's Motor City. This is my divorce, like honey child. Okay, guys. So now I'm gonna go off camera, do my lashes, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. I'm back. I put my lashes on, and I just did a pop of color, a pop of purple, at the bottom of my lash line, and the lashes I'm wearing. I'm wearing the IMB Kiss lashes in Wispy. The number of it, the number of it is 07. Um, this is my routine. Um, this has been my routine lately, especially the summer. So, um, I feel like do what works for you. Of course, um, I give you some tips and tricks on what I use because I have very, very oily skin. When it comes to dry skin, I can't relate because I don't have dry skin. I have oily, greasy skin. My skin can get very greasy, especially wearing makeup, depending on the foundation, depending on what um, primer I use, the sprays I use. I just, you know, whatever work, whatever starts to work, that's what I use, depending on the event. The time, the day, where I'm going, if I'm going to be there for hours. Like, I feel like you have to have every, if you're really, really, really into makeup and you want your makeup to last, like, you have to, you're going to have foundations for different occasions. You're going to have sprays for different occasions, depending on what look you want to go. You make. Sometimes you don't want to look matte all the time. It's up to you. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also... With this Aaliyah Gloss, I do have Aaliyah Times MAC Cosmetics collection review. I have a collection review and I have a second video on the collection doing another eye look. I will link everything in the description box. I will link everything in the cards to pop up. I got y'all set. So if y'all want to see anything, any other previous videos, everything will be in the description box. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to leave me a sweet comment in the comment section. Share this video. Follow on my social media so you can be updated on what I'm uploading, when I upload it. And don't, get, don't forget to hit that notification button so you can get notified every time I upload a video. So you can be the first to comment, the first to like, etc. So i see you guys in the next video. Everybody enjoy your weekend. I love you so much. Most likely this video will be up Saturday so it will still be the weekend. And laters.